It's the 44th new print show that we've done. We do juried shows of contemporary prints under a year old three times a year. We got uh, 3,000 submissions for this show. Some of the publishers are little tiny shops and some of them are big professional shops, but and some of them are nonprofit community workshops, and then a lot of them are independent artists all over the country. I think printmaking is a very exciting medium to a lot of people, and there's a lot of innovative work going on all the time, people experimenting with different techniques. We have lithography, etching, digital printmaking, mezzo tint, lino cut, wood cut, everything in this show. Well, it is nice to see a lot of works on paper all in one place, you know, like, they don't get a lot of attention in a world that's filled with canvas and fashion and things like that. just became very excited about the whole concept. He found it very magical, and I guess these are really magical books. The first book he collected was a very late edition of the Megendorfer book, and, but that's one of the earliest of the pop-up book series. Some of these books are so creative, and it's, uh, they're unusual, and so I was willing to go and extend this kind of uh, excitement for uh, other places. The one that I like best is the David Carter book that's uh, however many black dots, I have 500 or 600 black dots. That book to me really works as art. When you see it moving, that's wonderful too, but to me it's very, very good. It's beautiful engineering, but it also is very effective as art.